Hello and welcome back to more Hearts of Iron 4. We're playing the Great War Redux again. Plus waifus. Can't stop me from using that mod. Nobody can. Anyway, we are returning because the Balkans have gotten a revamp. Though Greece doesn't have a focus tree still. Sad face. So we're going to be playing as Austria-Hungary. So, starting off as Austria-Hungary. Our minorities don't like us. There's a lot of them. The Hungarians are having an election, and we're in a trade war with Serbia. Which one? This one. The Pig War, as it's called, apparently. Well, step one is to uh, limit minority activism, I guess. How are you the baddies? Oh boy, an assassination attempt on the governor. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with the National Work Party for the Hungarian elections. I'm not looking for Hungarian independence. No, no. No. I have been given a very interesting decision. The Hungarians have given me an ultimatum regarding the army and I have the option for them to give up or for Franz Joseph to abdicate in favor of Ferdinand. Ooh, how crazy do I want this to get? Uh, let's not get too crazy. Maybe some other time. Serbia lifts their embargo on me. Interesting. Well, I'm not lifting mine on you. I'm intent on keeping this trade war going. Sorry. God, I'm getting tired of these Slovakian activists. Let's, uh, integrate them. Wasting my peepee. -pee. Why is Cora the leader of Serbia? I'm not even sure she counts as anime. Hmm. Let's see if we can't stop the assassination. I think this is the way I have to go down to do it. Yeah, socialism. Ah, he's getting married. <laughs> is now very happy. Is, is that important? Back to the game. Please don't strike. I must be ready for the coming war. I don't need strikes. But the Italians are the most rowdy, so I need to get rid of them. Or pacify them. Not not, not get rid of them. Definitely not that. What? Serbia has abandoned the economic war. Haha. -ha. Does that mean I win? Nope. Oh, Cora's gone. Just do all of the decisions to Corgalicia Lodomeria. I knew I'd been saving up my pee, pee for something. Small pee, pee now. Yep, the autumn's time has come. Time for the first Balkan War. Oh, I can't send volunteers to Bulgaria like I do in Kaiserreich normally. No interfering for me. Albania? Oh, hey, Cora's back in Serbia. <laughs> It'd be nice if there was a description here to tell me what this focus does. But there isn't, so I guess I'll just have to find out. I might be a little blind. I thought that was an event that it fired off. No, it's a focus it unlocks. Please ignore my previous comment. <laughs> the first Balkan War is over. What's gonna happen? Oh, I'll... Independent Albania made a white piece, and that changed the borders slightly. This went to greet? What the hell's happening? Oh, there we go. Yeah, Bulgaria's not going to be happy. Also, tiny Albania. Isn't Albania supposed to get central Albania? I know before the update, I got an event that to demand Serbia give up central Albania. I... 
Let's not do this, Focus. No, different one. Ignore that one's existence. Bit ahead of its time, isn't it? Aha, no more, no more Slavic terrorism. Ferdinand will survive. At least that's what I've been led to believe. Oh, there goes Bulgaria. Eventually, Romania will get involved. Huh. I have the option to have the Archduke die early. Hmm. Though, after all the work I did to keep him from dying, maybe I don't want to do that. I'll say Lord Hitchfield has been hit. Oh, here we go. Now I get, now I get a uh, event for Albania. Yeah, Serbia, no. Albanian independence. Yay! The Albanian officials accepted our terms and gave independence to the Albanian territory. What? Did I have to threaten the Albanians? I don't know what's going on anymore. Okay. I wonder how the war is going to start since Ferdinand isn't going to die. Russia wants a non-aggression pact with me? Sure, buddy. Haha, Franz Ferdinand survives assassination attempt. Now what? It is 1915 and there is a surprisingly low amount of world tension. Hmm. Who's gonna start the war? I don't think I can. It is 1916. At this rate, Franz Joseph is going to croak before the war starts. I think the problem is... Germany... needs 25% world tension in order to get past this focus... to uh, force war with France. We're currently on 2%. What happened? Why is the world so peaceful? Ah, oh, finally! France declared war on Germany. I guess France isn't locked out of declaring war by <laughs> world tension. Weird. And they've canceled our non-aggression pact. The Great War has begun! Two years late. And, and Italy is on our side. Probably because the Great War didn't start how it was supposed to. Which means that the guarantees of independence actually happened. Okay, well. So I don't need to worry about Italy. Gotta rekajigger my whole front line. Welcome to the Central Powers. There you go. The Schlieffen plan has been engaged. And Germany didn't have anybody on the border when they did it. What is wrong with you? All right, time to join the war. Oh, come on, Italy. You're losing already. Ugh. And the Italian Navy is also incompetent. I would have rather had them as an enemy. You traitor. There goes Belgium. Uh, I never heard of it. Oh, Italy joining the Central Powers with the Ottomans in it caused them to give Libya back. Interesting. Oh, Italy's pushing finally. Good. Don't be incompetent. Oh my god, look at the Ottomans go. They're taking Egypt. This is a weird world. 
And there we go. Yep, there we go. Franz Joseph I has died. On to Franz Ferdinand I. Because he's alive. Where do we get to kill Serbia? Ah, there we go. Serbia is justifying against me. Ah, oh, damn it, Italy. Stop being incompetent. The fuck are your troops even? Oh, they're over here. Maybe take some of your troops back to your own front line. <laughs> uh, Italy. It's only. Oh god, there's three guys here. Four, sorry. Uh. Oh, Serbia has sent me an ultimatum. I'm so scared. Fuck off. Oh no, Serbia's here. Okay, join me. We'll kill them together. Well, I've just sort of uh, skirted around the entirety of Serbia. That was easy. <laughs> haven't haven't taken Beograd, but who needs to when I can take everything else? Oh look, another pocket. I should probably put this army on the border with Romania, because they're pretty sure they'll attack next. Yep, there they are. Come at me, Romania. Ah, and the Greeks have joined. They smell blood in the water. Mostly Italy's blood. I mean, look at them. Oh. It would seem that the Ottomans' gains in Egypt have been, uh... Nullified. So much for those high hopes. Ah, army epidemic. Oh boy. The war's only been going on for a year. Wow. Despite being in the middle of the Great War, I can't go to war economy because the world tension isn't at 40%. <laughs> Something's wrong with the uh, world tension right now. I don't want a good total, so, uh, partial it is, then. Uh, uh-oh. We're getting to that part of the game. It's too early. The war's only been going on for two years. I just started it late. Well, France started it late. Alright, the February Revolution. The Russians are close to capitulating. Or, well, piecing out. I shouldn't say capitulating. And now I have the influenza pandemic. Damn it. Oh, I can just skip straight to mass vaccination. Okay. Let's do that. Ah, there's the Bolsheviks. Just in time for my offensive. In fact, they're all gone. Uh, faster. Just go. How the hell did they get control of this? I was occupying that. Sneaky bastards. Oh, and Ukraine pops out of me. Well, that's just rude. Uh-oh. That's not good. I thought we were winning. Uh-oh. That's the part where the Americans join. Alright, everybody get down to Italy. We need to help them. Alright, I've crossed over into France proper from Italy. As long as I keep up my momentum, I think I can get this done before Germany decides to call it quits. Alright. Alright. The Treaty of Brest-Litovsk has been signed. Not that we need to worry about them anymore anyway. The Ludendorff offensive. Yeah, uh, I'm doing my own offensive, thank you. Oh, 
out and I white pieced out with Romania. Stored up the border a bit. Good, there, good sir, run to Paris. I've taken Paris, and the Entente surrenders. Now I just have to wait for the treaty to happen. Or, sorry, the armistice to take effect. And there we go, the armistice. I just have to wait 90 days for the Frankfurt Conference to determine the new borders. I don't think I'll get much. So is the life of an Austria. Oh! I can coo the Ukrainian bonnet in favor of myself rather than Germany. Yeah, let's do it. You know that. Well, oh, Germany doesn't like what I did. Uh, you'd better give us some booty before. I'm not gonna ask what that means, but I'm gonna do it. Belarus is just a little triangle. <laughs> Poor Belarus. Frankfurt Conference has happened, and I have eaten most of Serbia, except they still exist in Kosovo as my puppet. Um, that sounds very unstable, especially given what's happening in currently. Also, what? Why did it give the Ottoman Empire Eastern Macedonia? I know they have cores on it, but. Shouldn't Bulgaria have gotten it? Now, hold on a minute. There you go. Fixed it. There's now two United States in this world. Uh, shut up, Mexico. You don't count. There's two and nobody can tell me the other one. Yeah, uh, Hungary, shut up. We're going, we're going to be federals, federalist, and you're going to like it. And now they're rioting. Sorry, I didn't like being federalist, so I'm actually a triple monarchy now. Austria, austro hungaro croatia yeah. A much better name. <laughs> it's such a mouthful. Ukraine, what are you doing? What are you planning on doing with that? I'm, I shouldn't ask questions I don't want to know the answer to. Oh. The game has crashed. Well, the game keeps crashing, and it's the end anyway, so I'm gonna end it here. We didn't grow too much, but it was never really in Austria, Hungary, Croatia's what a name interest in order to do so anyway. I'm surprised I annexed Serbia. Certainly some bugs to work out in the new update, but I think it's good. So, I will see you all next time.